Huh? What's this? It looks like... Oh! I know what this is! This is a message in a bottle! That's right. Humans often use this as a way to communicate overseas. But... It looks like it's been here for a while. Like the person it was meant for never received it. The glass is starting to look opaque, just like other sea glass. Maybe... Maybe the person who was meant to receive it is... dead. Maybe they're never going to see what was meant for them. Maybe... Maybe I should take a look at it. See if I can determine who it was meant for, and maybe if I see them on the beach, I could relay the message. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'll do. After all, if they didn't find this bottle, odds are they're never going to find it ever. So, I guess looking wouldn't hurt. Am I just using this as an excuse to justify my curiosity? Yes, yes I am, but we're just going to ignore that for now. All right, let's see what's inside of this. Oh... This looks like... It looks like this paper was damp before it was placed in the bottle. The way these blotches have formed... It's like the person who was writing it was... Crying. Oh, goodness. What does it say, though? Some of the writing is smudged. I can't see the name of the person it was meant for. Oh, well, let's just... Start with the first sentence and see if we can read that. Let's see. Dear someone, I wake up every morning remembering your smile. I go to sleep every night missing your touch. I remember the warm embrace we used to share each night and on cold days. I remember the way your eyes always lingered on mine. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh goodness, is this, is this a love message of some kind? Oh my, maybe I shouldn't be reading this, but maybe if they describe the person they're writing to in this letter, I can find out who it was meant for. Yeah, yeah, just like I originally planned. So, though it is private information, I should probably keep reading, right? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'll do. All right. Damn it, where was I? Oh, there it is. Every time the breeze blows, I remember your voice. It used to whisper to me, lovingly, reassuringly, and it was as soft and as gentle as the breeze that blows through my hair. I miss you. I miss you with all of my heart. But sometimes, oh my goodness, sometimes I wish that I could forget you. I wish that I could move on from you. I wish that I wasn't haunted by the memory of you. Because every time I think of you, my heart sinks to the bottom of my stomach. My eyes become watery and overflow with tears. My body begins to tremble, and the others look at me like I've gone mad. I miss you. I miss you, and wish I could be in your arms again. But I need to forget you. I need to get rid of this pain in my chest. I need to let you move on, by moving on myself. I'm sorry, but I just can't bear to remember the person I loved now that they're dead. Oh my goodness. So this... This isn't really meant to be received by anyone. Oh my... Wait a second. I think I recall a legend of some kind that if you put a message in a bottle and you wrote down what you wanted or what you wished for, threw it into the sea, 
and waited. That wish, that desire of yours would be fulfilled. So the person who wrote this message, are they really trying to forget their lost love? Or was this some strange attempt at venting? I wonder if they are trying to forget. Maybe I could help them. I might not be the strongest, and I do possess very little magic, but if remembering causes them this much pain, perhaps if I wait for them, try to approach them, I could grant their wish. Huh? What's that? That sounds like... Crying? Oh! Crying! Maybe... Maybe that's the person who wrote this! Oh, I should bring it with me. Alright, um... How do I even approach them? I can't just... Go out of the water and dry myself so that my legs appear. That would never work. After all, they would surely be gone by the time I was dry enough to walk to them. And even if I did make it in time, I haven't any clothes, and humans are oddly obsessed with covering every square inch of their bodies. Okay, come on, come on, think. Do I really just have to swim up to them and hope for the best? I suppose... I suppose that is my only choice at this time. Hopefully I don't scare them too badly. Okay, okay, just take a deep breath. Calm yourself down. If you appear calm, they'll remain calm. Hopefully that still holds true. After all, it's true for my kind, and we're similar enough to humans. Surely it'll work between the two of us, right? Okay, let's just... Give it a try. Um... Hi there. Oh, my apologies. I didn't mean to startle you. I... I heard you crying. I wanted to see what was wrong. You missed someone? Did you perhaps lose a loved one recently? You did? And, by chance, did you write a letter, put it in a bottle, and throw it out to the sea? You did! Well, um... I found your message. I... I apologize. I was incredibly curious, and... I excused my curiosity by saying that if I read it, I'd be able to relay the message to whoever it was meant for. That was wrong of me, I know, but... I'm glad that I read it. You see... I possess very little magic, but it would be enough to make you forget your loved one if you really miss them so terribly. Oh? You possess magic yourself? I didn't realize that humans had magic. What kind of magic can you do? All sorts of magic? That's incredible. So, are all humans capable of this, or only a select few? Oh, I see. Everyone is capable of it, but you have to learn how to harness your skills? Interesting. So, are you still human, or are you something different? You're a witch? I've heard stories of witches. Usually they're portrayed as terrible people who will trick you, but you don't seem that way. You had a loved one, after all. Clearly you cared about them, and they cared about you. So... I doubt you're as bad as the witches in stories. My name? My name's Armin. It's nice to meet you. Uh, I... I'm sorry, I... 
I didn't mean to frighten you. I... I can go if you want me to. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have swum up to you so quickly. I apologize. I... Huh? What do you mean by that? My name? I... I just told you, didn't I? Okay. My name's Armin. Armin Arlert. <laughs> um... Um, why do you... Why do you look like you're about to cry again? Did I... Did I say something to upset you? Did I scare you? I... I can go if you want me to. <gasps> okay. Okay, it's okay. I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Do you... Do you want me to come closer? You look like you could use a hug or... Or just a shoulder to cry on. Do you want me to come closer? Okay, okay. There. Is that better? Oh! Oh, goodness, um, hey, hey, it's okay, it's gonna be okay, it's alright, hey, hey, everything's okay, everything's gonna be alright, it's okay. No, no, don't say that, I know things might seem bad now, but you're gonna be okay, I promise, things always turn out for the better, don't they? At least, for a while they do. Right? What? Do I... remember you? I... I don't see many humans on the beach. I'm afraid... If I did see you at one point, I wouldn't remember you after all this time. I'm sorry. Oh, no, no, no. Please don't cry more. Hey, hey. Hey, what's wrong? Did I... Did I say something to upset you? What's going on? Huh? I... I forgot about you? What do you mean? You and I were... Together? But... I've never been with a human before. I've never been with anyone before. I... I don't know what you're referring to. I'm sorry. I was... I was... human once? Are you sure about that? I would think I would remember something like that. As far as I know, I've always been like this. I... I was a human. I had the same name and... I looked the same? Really? <laughs> I... I died? Ow. Whoa, 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 slow down, slow down. Hey, hey, you're starting to cry again. I really want to help you. I really do, but if you keep crying when you're trying to speak, I can't understand what you're saying, and then I can't help you. Come on, just take a big, deep breath with me. All right. Let it out slowly, okay? Yeah, just like that. Oh, you're doing so well. Okay, take another big, deep breath. And let it out slowly. Really? I... I used to do that for you? Tell me, if you can... What happened to me? I was... Taken prisoner by... Marlians? Are they like Marlins, or are they people? I see. And 
What happened then? I was... restrained? I couldn't transform. What do you mean by that? <laughs> I could... I could turn into a titan? You mean... one of those... Giant humans who are always coming from the sea, it would appear? I see. But I wasn't like those ones? Oh, so? Oh. I could think and act like a human and turn back into a human? So... I was restrained by the Marlians after I was captured, and that meant that I couldn't transform, but what happened after that? You attacked the ship? And... Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness. So... So you were trying to get me back, but... In doing so, you... Oh my... Hey, hey, hey! It's okay, it's okay! Look at me, look at me. There's no need to apologize, I promise. Listen, everything's okay now. We found each other again, didn't we? I... I'm really sorry that... I don't remember you. I really wish that I did. I wish that I could remember all the time we spent together and the person that I used to be. After all, you seem like a very nice person. I'm sure that the time we spent together was nothing short of extraordinary. But even without my memories, I... I do feel connected to you. I feel like I'm meant to love you, just like I once did. And you know what? I think that maybe you and I could be together again. Yeah! Yeah, I mean it. Listen, I'm not sure how much you know about my kind, but I can dry myself off and in place of my tail will be a pair of legs, just like yours. Oh. Yes, I would have to come back to the sea at some point, but after I rehydrate myself... After I've spent a little while in the water, I'll be able to come right back to you. I promise. Huh? You don't want that? What do you mean? You don't want me to constantly be running back and forth between you and the sea? Then, what are we going to do? <laughs> You're going to... find a spell to turn me... fully human? Are you sure you want to do that? I'd hate to put any undue stress on you. Really, I could probably find a spell myself. Really? You want to do this? Okay. Okay, if you're sure. Then, how about you get going, and I'll wait here for you. Right here, right at this spot, okay? Oh, don't worry about the tide. It's actually high tide right now, if you couldn't tell. Don't worry, I'll be fine. No, the tide won't move out for a while, I promise. Just go. 
I'll still be waiting here for you when you come back. I promise. You're scared? Why's that? Hey. Hey, look at me. If you leave me this time, you aren't going to lose me. I promise, okay? Why don't you run along? The quicker you come back, the quicker you can see me again. And besides, I know the sea well enough. Even if it takes you a while to come back and I have to go farther into the water, I know my way around. I'll be perfectly fine this time. Now, run along, you. I'll be waiting. Right here. I promise.